listen, I'm a lover girl. I need me a lover boy, okay? Oh, you nonchalant, toxic <laughs> stay the with me. Like, I want the <laughs> will tell you they love you 69 times a day. You breathed, I love you. Like, every greatest love story that exists, I want to experience a version of it for myself. Is that too much to ask for? No, I just be asking the wrong mother <laughs> Everybody want to be cool. Everyone want to be nonchalant. I want chalantness. If you're these toxic nonchalant, not worshipping the ground Walk on a Bye. Translation. She wants the dudes that don't give her that type of attention to give her that type of attention. But what's funny is once the dudes that she likes gives her that type of attention, she's not going to want them no more. That's the funny part about it. But here's the thing. Why should I worship the ground that you walk on when you want a leader? Will a leader be worshiping the ground that you walk on? So what you want is a man that's focused on you. You want a man that is making you the purpose. But what's gonna happen in that situation is you're gonna end up being the very thing you don't wanna be. You're gonna end up being the man because you're gonna attract feminine type of dudes. That's why I have an issue when women make these type of statements. And then she says something about, well, you know, I want a dude that hits me up with 69 good morning messages. Well, that's called stalkerish vibes. That's called writing a police report on me. I guarantee you, if I hit a woman up 69 times, I guarantee you the police gonna be showing up to my door, bang, bang, with a letter saying that it's a restraining order. And y'all know on this channel, I don't ever come on here and try to bash women or different things like that. I always keep it on the man, but those type of women you gotta stay away from because, you know, I tell dudes all the time, like how you start something out with a woman is how you gonna have to continue it. So if you somehow pull a woman and, and she becomes your girlfriend and you chased her all the way through, well, during the relationship, you're going to have to continue to chase her, So, which is not natural. And I know some, some women will say, well, you're not supposed to, you know what I'm saying, why do we got to be the ones to chase and all this different type of things? So naturally, as the man is chasing his focus and he's focused on his craft and his bigger mission, the woman is going to be right along his side helping him get to that mission that's that's the purpose you know what i'm saying so how can i be doing that and be hitting you up 69 times a day don't even focus on those type of women because those type of women will destroy you you'll text her 69 times and you'll have 69 blue balls every single day you know what i'm saying because you know what i'm saying she's not gonna really rock with you like that she's gonna be turned off from it so the whole point of this is Never pay attention to what a woman is saying. Always pay attention to what a woman is doing. His actions speak louder than words. She can say that all day, but really what she's mad at is that little baby and little dirt is not blowing her line up every day. You know what I'm saying? Because I guarantee you, if you go to that woman's Instagram DMs, if you go to her DMs, if you go to her text messages, if you go to her hinge messages, if you go to her Tinder messages, if you go to her Snapchat messages, I guarantee you it's blowed up with dudes saying good morning. I guarantee you. I guarantee you her messages are blowed up with dudes saying good morning. But you know what it is? She wants the dudes that necessarily don't pay a lot of attention to her to do that. That's the funny part. She wants the dudes who don't do that to do that. If you have a thousand dudes and your message is doing it, but guess what? That's not good enough. You know what I'm saying? That's not what you want. You want the dudes who you want to, to do that. So you want the nonchalant dudes to be chalant, but that's not how it works. And you know, again, guys, when you hear, you know, talk like that, all that woman wants to do is, it's, it's a power tactic. She wants to have leverage over the situation. And that's all she wants at the end of the day. She wants leverage. She's tired of not having power, but if that woman can just understand, see the thing is she's looking at it from the wrong angle, right? As a feminine woman, you should be looking to like, dang, how can I make this man's life easier? You know what I'm saying? How can I make, you know what I'm saying? Because if you make a man's life easier, that dude will keep you in his life. At the end of the day, man, all we want is a feminine woman who's nurturing, who believes in us, and that's it. That's all we really want at the end. A feminine woman who believes in us, that's, that's nurturing, you know what I'm saying? That's, that's um, she's not argumentative and she can communicate. That's all we want. So if you can do that, you will be getting these same dudes that you claim you don't want no more. You know what I'm saying? So all that, oh, he got to text me 69 times a day. He got to worship the ground that I walk on. That's BS. Because you're going to be, t she's going to be turned off by that. You know what I'm saying? Think about that. Think about, man, 
I know a lot of y'all men haven't experienced this, but when I when I experience women blowing my line up and women being all thirsty, it's a turn off. Because it's like, ew, ew. You know what I'm saying? Like for real? You got nothing else going on but to blow my line up all day? That's how I be feeling. So I already know how it is to when you're a woman and you got a thousand dudes blowing you up. You don't see no value in that. You know what I'm saying? Because it's already, I already know what you want. You think a billionaire has time just to be sending a thousand good morning texts? No, he's sending, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, he's sending good morning in his emails to his team at the beginning of the draft. Yeah, that's what he's doing. That, that's who he's sending good morning to. You to check in with his team to make sure everything is flowing right. You know what I'm saying? So at the end of the day, a man that's purposeful and driven, he don't have time to sit there and text good morning a thousand times a day. You know what I'm saying? But these dudes that ain't got nothing going on, they can do that for you. The man that's focused, the man that's driven, a man that got goals, a man that got ambition, he doesn't have time to be worshiping the ground that you walk on. He is chasing after something. He is chasing success. You know what I'm saying? Look at LeBron and his wife. Savannah's been right along his side, but she ain't never complained. You know she's always kept it loyal, kept it real. You know what I'm saying? Never complained. But LeBron is a busy dude. You know what I'm saying? I don't even care if it's the off season. He got brand deals. He got a he got a um, respond to. He got he got play. He got commercials. He got to shoot. He may have movies. He got to go. You know, speak at different organizations. He got his own school. So a man like that has things going on all the time. You know what I'm saying? So at the end of the day, yeah, you asking for a dude to worship the ground that you walk on, but you, you're not realizing that that type of dude ain't gonna have nothing going on with his life. And those are not the type of man that's over here on my channel. The man that's over here, we're gonna continue to focus on ourselves, continue to um, grind, continue to, um, you know what I'm saying, to, to, to have more hobbies, continue to rock with people who rock with us. And that's what it's all about over here, man. So at the end of the day, man, when you hear a woman talk like that, man, don't don't even pay no type of attention because all it is, it, it, it's a move of leverage. You know what I'm saying? She just wants the power. It's leverage at the end of the day. All right, guys, that's my um, video for today. Guys, make sure if you want one on one consultations, um, click the link in the description below. And also as well, if you just need to change your mindset and the way you think to help, you know what I'm saying? And this is in byproduct get you more women. Um, I definitely have a I got an ebook for that. Link is in the description, it's only $15. Um, go ahead and go cop that. And also guys, make sure you continue to like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. And I'm gone.